Okay, here's a bullish Harami, uh, basically at a kind of a swing low. Um, and what we see is it's not textbook style, but that's kind of what we're going to find when we look at stock charts. And you need to get used to identifying the patterns that don't look exactly like they do in the book. The, the bottom line of what qualifies this pattern is that um, um, we are opening above the close of the previous day and closing below the open of the previous day. So we're inside the real body of the previous day, and um, it doesn't really matter of uh, what the what the wick does or the shadow. In this case, it did make a nice high right here, and to verify the 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 bullishness of the pattern, what we do is we draw a line. This these lines, this one here and this one here, represent the open and the close of the previous day. So we see that the real body of the next day is within. Uh, within the open and close of the previous day. This line right here is our trigger for our long entry where we entered on the open right here or maybe even at the close right here. Maybe we entered at the high, just depends upon our strategy. Price open and then continue to move up nicely. So that's the bullish Harami. Let's look for a couple more. Okay, here's another bullish Harami. A little bit more textbook, a little bit more at a bottom and uh, oversold market conditions. Okay, we have uh, a nice move down, a nice close below, cl a nice close below, a two standard deviation Bollinger Band, and then a little open right above it here, and then a, cl a close right here. Uh, in this case, um, what we do, okay, this is a nice bullish harami. We draw a line above the high right here, and come across, and you can see that we wouldn't enter this thing to either this candlestick here or this one here and then um, we entered and we either had a system where we stopped out at, a, at the 21 day moving average on the Bollinger Band or we ended up getting stopped out. Um, uh, in the case of a bullish Harami, um, there's different techniques you can use to apply your stop. Uh, but in this case, uh, we did enter long, let's just say in this candlestick right here, price did move up and then it moved against us. But this is a nice bullish Harami right here. Uh, more than likely, you'd get stopped out of this. Unless we take a look at the prevailing trend. Let me try to make a little bit of a note right here so we can see the bigger trend. And we can see that we were kind of uptrending when we took this trade. So it would be potentially likely that we would exit this trade uh, at least a little early on. Probably a break even, actually. So that's the bullish Harami in action. Hope that helps.